Sunday night, March 18th. <clears throat> Putting this 20-footer all in by myself. Trying. I don't know. I guess I'm impatient. Trying to figure out ways uh, if the Egyptians can get the pyramids, maybe I can do this, huh? That's what somebody said one time. Anyway, yeah, that went over there. I got just about all the way up by myself, and then the neighbor came over and helped me the very last bit. But this one, no neighbor over there yet. I hooked up this kind of deal where it's like a lever. Found a nail in there, and as I lift it, that's how I do it. As I'm holding on to this just a little bit to show you. Here it goes. <clears throat> See it lift like that. As I push the levers here, I'm riding on a 2 by 6 a little short piece on top of the studs nailed in two places each, left and right side. I've already cut away the top. And what I do is when I get it almost near the bottom, resting on the... i got a double plate over there, see that? When I get it right right before I have to lift it up onto there, I, uh, I'll figure out what I'll do then, I guess. No, I'll nail board to it, make it so it won't slip back. And now, very importantly, these boards under my feet here, they go back here to this wall over there. If it wasn't for these boards, this thing would slide back and just fall if it got momentum. It's done it to me over there before. So I put these boards to stop this thing, and as I inch it forward, like when I do this here, this will probably move this 20-foot post, over 200-pound post, over 20 foot tall. This will probably move it about a foot, maybe, hopefully. And then I'll have to unpry it and put them back in the same nail spots. Yeah, the same nail spots are getting kind of weak, but I'll just use new nail spots. It's tedious, but maybe I'll get it up. I'll give it a shot and get back with you real quick. Over and out. <laughs>